Uh, William Benoit, five dollars. Another lo another lolly stream to get me through a boring workday. Yep. Yep. It's not gonna be great. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's gonna be fantastic. Read that fucking title. Read yeah. that title. Hung Teddy for two dollars. Shota, do you think you can dominate King Kong? You already have. Uh, how do I get into the Discord? I uh, you have to donate to the subscribe star page, which I did put a link in the uh, description. And I found out YouTube really likes to fuck up links. Thank you, boy. It'll it'll shorten the link down. Like if you're on mobile and you just check, like I put on community post, it'll yeah. shorten it down. If you try to copy the link from there, it will literally copy it literally. So it'll add like the ellipses were just shortened off. Mm -hmm. Now that link won't work. He turned us into fucking killers. And I did not know that. People were complaining like, "Hey, I cannot get to uh, your your link thing because it doesn't fucking work." And I had no idea what they're talking about. Turns out they just fucked it up. Mm -hmm. So I literally have to go to the website on my computer, copy the link, and post it to, like, any community post. Regardless of, like, what I want to do. It's annoying. It's fucking terrible. No more. Now you read chat. There's only one thing we can do <laughs> to earn redemption. We're gonna save this stream. We're gonna do it, guys. We're gonna save the stream. And there's only one way... One possible way we can save the stream. Oh, wait, hold up. If you're if you're gonna sell it that hard, then I have to. We have to. <laughs> we're, we're gonna save this stream the only way we know how. If you're gonna try that hard, then I have to go balls deep. You're, we're going the ballsiest deep. All right, motherfuckers, you've been waiting for it. Are you ready to rumble? We're finally going to listen to the people. To the people and give them what they want, what they've been begging for. According to the straw poll, this is what chat wanted. This is what chat's wanted all along. All we, night long. We have tapped in to what you've all been dreaming for. <laughs> I don't like where this is lolly. <laughs> don't do it. What what are you talking about? We're doing this for you! We've learned our lesson. We don't want to play bad video games anymore. We want to play something fun. Guys. We promised Virgil. Guys. We promised Virgil. We're going to give you fucking Virgil. Guys, come on. All of that was just a tease. All of that was us being assholes. But I learned my lesson. If we promise Virgil, we got to give Virgil. Otherwise, Virgil gives us a bad time. Exactly. We're going to do it. We're doing it. Bury the light, motherfuckers. We're doing it. The hit video game... The hit video game topping every sales chart in North America. Devil May Genshin Impact. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Guys, it's okay, I swear, I swear to God. Virgil. There you go. Come Virgil. on, Virgil. Virgil. See? We, 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 we swear up and down. Swear up and down. Hello, Virgil. Alright, time to relearn the game. Yep. They're saying volume to the max. Hey. You say volume to the max. Out of my way. That's volume to the max. Oh dear lord. Y'all, y'all are gonna sit here and watch me get the fucking timing down on God. Yeah. Carson twenty seventy seven for a dollar. I'd rather watch Yoda rip a Skinwalker Wendigo than that shit. And still waiting for my invite. I'm gonna do it after. Don't move. Like you right can get now, into the after stream, don't worry. Yeah. Out of my way. Down you go. Take it, boy! It's getting out for 10 for $6. Open the glowies come for you. They violate the two of you more than Griffin violating Oscar. <laughs> Where are that? Uh, Daddy Vio, $5. Why must you stream on nights I have work the next day? Also, love the Devil's Rejects, babe. Might actually watch it all the way next time I see it. 
It's on bed shoot, so. I was gonna say, next time you see it, unfortunately. Who the hell is Trish? Weird tentacle lady. Tentacle hair lady. Uh, Trish is the blonde haired one that. Take it, boy! Yeah. Might be Dante's mom. She's based off of Dante's mom. Yeah. Not actually Dante's yeah. mom, but like, based off of her. Yeah. You have, like, for the cast, for those that do not know what Devil May Cry is, you have Dante, which is the red gay cowboy, as the dumbass that directed the remake uh, um, referred to as. Uh, but can you fucking imagine that being like being so out of touch with the property you own or, or being given control over? And make an objectively worse version of that property. Right. To the point Capcom makes a new game out of spite. It's fucking ridiculous. Yeah. Fucking, um... You have Dante who is the demon hunter who, you know, he's a cocky guy. He likes fighting. He likes doing all the crazy shit. Basic anime protagonist. Uh, but he has, he has some layers. You know, he feels bad that his mom died. He feels bad that he basically killed his brother. Uh, brush over that, though. Um, he turned the volume up a little more on the game. Are you fucking sure? Yeah. They want, they want Barry the Light to be fucking blazing, but they don't understand. Yeah, they don't understand. But fucking, um... Uh, Trish is the friend slash co-worker slash hostile mommy figure of hostile. Dante. Uh, but she's cool. He you know, turned us like into fucking killers! Ziaden donated two euro jackpot. Jackpot. You have Virgil, who is Dante's brother. And they basically have conflicting philosophies. Yeah. Dante does not give a shit about becoming an ultra-powerful demon. Uh, because to him, it's like, well, what happened to mom happened. It sucks, but fuck it. I'm just going to kill demons to make money. Yeah. I have a life to live. Well, Virgil's the exact opposite. It was, I'm never letting that happen again. Even if I do grow to care about somebody, they can be taken away. So I need to be as powerful as possible. Which, ironically... Vir Virgil's the real Chad. It ironically leads him down very bad roads. The chattest of all, even. Yeah. Uh, and they fight a lot. Except... So, no, man, they're, they're French. Shut up. Yeah. I mean, I fucking asshole. I gotta get yeah. back in the swing of things. Then you have fucking uh, Lady. Lady is one of my favorite characters. I like her a lot. She's cool. Yeah. She is a demon hunter Dante met who... Okay, everyone else in in DMC lore has some form of a supernatural ability. They're all tied to demons or have demonic powers. Lady has guns. And that's, that's why needs. I like her. That's all she needs. She is yeah. cool. Quite, quite literally all she needs. Yeah. Uh, then you have Nero. Nero was introduced in Devil May Cry 4. Yes. No one really knew anything about him beyond he was part demon... He had white hair, and people started speculating who he might be. Where it's like, wait a minute, how is he related to, to Virgil and Dante? Right. Come five, you find out, oh yeah, he's Dante, uh, he's Virgil's son. Yeah. Like, Virgil fucked. Virgil fucked, just so he could beat Dante to it. Well, then you find out Virgil ripped off his own son's arm in order to create a ritual to become a full blown demon remove all humanity and become Urizen. Yeah. then he gets his ass kicked and he becomes Virgil still gets his ass kicked and he realizes okay maybe I'm being an idiot maybe I'm being stupid yeah so now him and Dante are in hell forever fighting demons and they're finally they're finally brothers as the, the way God intended yeah but she's great in the anime like Oh, yeah. Having her be the one that just steals his money all the time. Oh, that's fucking great. It's sort of like you Faye me. from Bebop, only she's the loan shark. You owe me money, Dante. No, I don't, you crazy bitch. Leave me alone. It's like, I finally have money for food. I haven't eaten in days. Yeah, you still need to pay me back. I hate you. Yeah, you still need to pay me back. Why? Because I can decide the price of my guns after you use them. Oh. Why was the DMC remake bad? Literally every single thing people liked about DMC was shat on. Yeah. The obvious example everyone points to is the wig scene. A wig falls on Dante's head and he's like, oh, not in a million years. 
That was not even step one of what was wrong with that fucking game. Oh, yeah. Like, it literally was not Devil May Cry. Yeah. It's just nothing but disrespect, G. Yeah. Where you, you literally had the fucking um, director of the game come out and specifically say, yeah, I don't like the originals. Fuck the originals, fuck Dante. And it made you wonder, like, then why the fuck are you remaking Devil May Cry? Right, How, why are you being an asshole? Yeah, why are you attacking people that are like, hey, I love these games, I literally grew up with them, why are you being a dick? And not just that, but like, every single thing they added to the lore was just... It wasn't good. Yep. I mean, literally, it came down to, it sucked, like... You can, there's like the, there, there's like the demon dimension, and like, there, there's like the real world, and you can, you can get there through using, like, cat piss and squirrel shit. Yeah. It's like, yeah, I didn't like- Oh, I forgot about this room! Yeah. I forgot about this room! You have fun with the lizards. <laughs> but it's like, wasn't the guy shit-talking Trish super hard and saying she was a damsel, and then having the new Trish- I don't Literally know. be a fucking- you're up to maybe more like Lady, but like still. Yeah, but like, I don't remember, what was her name? The, the fucking hipster witch girl. I don't remember her I, name. I know who you're talking about, I just don't remember her name. Yeah, she literally did nothing. Meanwhile, in DMC 1, Trish kicked a lot of ass. Oh yeah. She killed shitloads of- she's as strong as Dante. Yeah, you literally boss fight her, man. Yeah. She is a boss fight. Fucking Devil May Cry 3 with Lady, if we do want to take it to- oh, she's supposed to, you know, be a replacement for Lady, because Lady was a damsel. Lady fought Dante! Yeah, and held her own. She worked with him and she just has guns. Like Yeah, literally. She like she doesn't have cool like demon powers or anything. Oh you're a bitch. And if you play as her in four, she has an entire combat system specifically around juggling enemies with guns. Like, holy shit. And then fucking um and then you get to fucking Virgil. Virgil was done the dirtiest. Oh, yeah. Like, you really like Virgil, too. Yeah, Virgil's my favorite fucking DMC character, man. And they, they fucking... They shit all over him. Like, they got the entire premise of the fucking character wrong because they thought, for some reason, like, he couldn't be cool. And here's the thing. Like, if they wanted to sit there and do what... If they wanted to sit there and do what they did with Virgil to begin with... Which is like, okay, Virgil's not like the bad guy right now. Virgil's actually like the good guy. Like, you know what? I'd I'm willing to that. I'm willing to work with that. I'd be down with that. But at the very end of the game, out of nowhere, they go, Alright, but like Virgil's actually the super big bad guy and he just wanted Dante to do all the legwork because he's like super weak, but like he's actually super strong though, but like but like Yeah. And it's like if he was as strong as he is, why did he even need Dante to do anything? Yeah. Daddy Bio five dollars. Meant the actual movie. I saw part of Devil's Rejects a year after it came out when I was eleven. It reminds me of the time I watched BDSM porn at age six. Yeah, it's one of those movies, man. Yeah. Some people hate it. They hate it. You know, you know. Fedora Virgil. Yeah, like literally Fedora Virgil. They had to patch it out of the fucking game because people wouldn't stop making fun of it. And it's had, like, what the fuck did you expect? He had powers but could not fight yeah. Mundus. That is stupid. Literally, like, and they he, established he, he was as strong as Dante. He had more powers than Dante, technically. Yeah, like, it's one of those where it legitimately got to the point of, then why is he even pretending to be weak? <laughs> it only makes sense if you think about it from the perspective of he was fucking with Dante. And guess what? Actual Virgil wouldn't do that. He would be like, no, I'm going to one-up you because I'm stronger, asshole. He would make a point to Dante that I'm better than you. Like, that's literally the entire point of his character. And and not even just that, but, like, the fucking sniper rifle abortion. Like, oh my god. Yeah. If you want to have Virgil do that sudden, dude, what the fuck, that was hardcore. Have him just literally teleport and cut her head off. Right, or something, like, something not stupid, like, fucking sniper rifle abortion. Yeah, we're, god, that was, like, holy shit. Why did the DMC remake come out? Because that was during the time when Capcom was genuinely trying to westernize every franchise. I did it. Yeah. 
Like, they were trying to westernize Devil, Devil May Cry. They were trying to westernize uh, Resident Evil. Yeah, they tried to westernize everything, and it backfired spectacularly because guess what people don't actually like? Yeah. Everything being homogenized. They fucking hate it, in fact. Virgil's kind of a cocky guy, but not some sort of sadist. Exactly! Like, Dante is the emotional one. He's the guy that is all about, who cares, you know? I'm just gonna go with the flow, baby. You know, I'm not gonna think about anything. It's all about instinct and feeling. Virgil's the opposite. Like, he's literally the opposite. He is stone cold. Yeah. Like, to him, it's all about, how do I get from point A to point B? Like, I don't know why I did that. Yeah. I don't know why I did that. Uh, I've seen the levels of madness reached with, uh, all right, with Kickstarter canceled because they had a picture of an actual frog and it was considered a white supremacy symbol. Yeah. I'm actually shocked that people still let idiots do that. Or it's like, they're, they're trying to use in court that Kyle Rittenhouse did the okay symbol with his hand and he was trying to like dog whistle the white supremacist. I'm shocked people yeah. let that have legitimacy. Yeah. Where it's like, why do you, why does anyone let them say that? You call them a fucking retard. And if they try to say, well, no, they actually adopted after the facts. Like, because you idiots fell for it. You idiots played into it, so they're gonna make fun of you. You fucking idiots. Sniper rifle abortion? Yeah, it is an actual thing. Um, they're, Mundus is like succubus, uh, booty hole fucking is pregnant, right? Yeah. And they kidnap her to use as a bargaining chip to get, uh... The fucking female, whatever female, female character uh, is the replacement for Trish. I forget her fucking name. Yeah. Squirrel semen bitch. Dante to is get, not love interest. To get her back, they they offer to trade a uh, uh, trade his his uh, succubus chick who is pregnant. And one just really only cares about about the baby. He doesn't really care about her. He just wants he just wants his, his baby. He wants his heir. Uh, so what they do is they they sit there they set up the trade. And uh, the trade goes fine. Mundus, Mundus is a man of his word. He doesn't fuck him over. And Virgil is sitting back with a fucking Barrett 50 cal and just blows a hole through her stomach. For no reason. Which just kills the baby. Just to kill the baby. Like, and he did it for no reason. Yeah, literally no reason. It was only to show Virgil's kind of evil. Yeah, that, like, that. literally that is it. And, like, oh my god. Ugh. It, it, it's one of those games that's actually exhausting to think about because you just keep it keeps stacking up the and, problems and like people people will defend it to the death and it's just because they they don't like Devil May Cry. It was the first game they played in the series. I'm 100% convinced it's that. Like they they just want something to defend. Yeah. There there's no other way I can describe that. It to me it's the Bioshock Infinite thing. It was the first game you played in the series. And so you're going to defend it, even though it has a lot of objective problems. Yeah. Like, that. that's how Kat. I see it. Her name is Cat. Cat, yeah. What an American. Did you play the Virgil DLC for DMC? Textbook character yes. assassination. He blames everyone else for the things he did. And OG Virgil doesn't do that. He takes that shit with pride. The reason, the reason Virgil wants to get stronger is because he believes... Everything that happened to his parents or his mother was because he was too weak. Was his fault. It's the exact opposite of it's everyone else's fault. He owns up to everything, no matter what. Like, the ending of 5 is Dante literally going, you killed a lot of people. And Virgil just goes, who cares? Yeah. Like, who gives a shit? So what? What are you going to do about it, pussy? Yeah. Like, even V! Uh, for those that haven't beaten 5 yet, it's... You had your chance. Fuck you. You had your chance. Get the fuck out of chat. Yeah, you had your chance. V is literally the humanity of Virgil that he cut out to become yours. It's literally the human side of Virgil. That's yeah. why he's so weak compared to Virgil. V was blaming himself for yours getting powerful. Yeah. Like, Virgil does nothing but blame himself. So, he he knows it's all his fault. Yeah. Then after the woman cries, he shoots her in the head too. Yeah. yeah. Like, he does it for no he, reason. He lets her start crying because he's just so cool. Yeah. It, it's so stupid. Ninja Theory had no idea what the fuck they were doing. Right. 
Not even, not even a little bit. The freeze! Get out of here, Virgil! Just keep running! Taunt! Taunt! Taunt to win! Taunt to win! Taunt to win! Fly away! Fly away, my beautiful baby boy! The MC sounds like it was purpose-built to piss off the original fans. It kind of was! Like, it actually kind of was. The the dude who fucking directed uh, DMC openly hated the fans. Like, actually got into fights on Twitter with the fans. Man, I... God. Yeah, it's bad. Man. It is, too. DMC is an uncanny spinoff. Yeah. Yeah. Capcom basically made it that way, where it's like, nope, we are not sticking with this. Is there anything about DMC that you like? Um... I have one very distinct thing I can, I can tell you I like. Oh, fuck. I got her. I got her bad. It's the goat things. I hate the goat things. Mm -hmm. I guess... Goats and Furies, baby. Yep. Here you go. I guess if you really had to twist my arm, I liked the whole they live style demon dystopia. Uh I can give I can actually I can actually give you a handful of things that I liked about it. Uh, by handful I mean at least two. Or three. I liked I did like the they live type thing. If they wanted to do that in like normal DMC but different, I'd be fine with that. I would not hate them. Uh I liked the level design. The level design was better than anything we had seen at that point, in my opinion, and was actually varied. Like, you had significantly varied level design. It wasn't oh, all yeah. just, okay, this is the outside part of the map. This is the urban part of the map. This is the sewer part of the map. It was all very distinct stuff. And for all their wrongdoings of Virgil, they gave us the Mirage system in 5 yeah. with your doppelganger. And that's, I fucking love it. Yeah. That was not a bad idea. Not even close to a bad idea. I, that is probably the best idea to come out of that game. Yeah. And it genuinely makes you wonder where they stole it from. <laughs> yeah, I know. Like, there's no way you came up with that on your own. Right. What difficulty are you on? Uh, Legendary Dark Knight. Yeah. It, it uh, has a bunch of like, later game enemies early on. Yeah. Later game enemies, plus there's a shitload of them all at once during a fight. Yeah. Woo! Plus me and him are, are both super fucking rusty, so we're just yeah. trying to get our bearings on it again. Yeah. It playing at 60 definitely helps. Oh, yeah. Like, those inputs Woo! are smooth. The only funny thing about DMC by Ninja Theory is them trying to make people know get Dante is not a gay cowboy. Yeah. And, and fucking... Five leans so hard into it. Yeah. Like, Five's just having fun, man. Yeah. Oh, you motherfuckers. Wombo combo my cock. My cock. Steal a soul for a second chance, but you'll never become a man. Damn. I'm still pissed we don't have a Lady in Church DLC for this. Mm -hmm. I'm still pissed. I played DMC2 all the way through with both characters, and I'm not joking. It was so depressing, it genuinely made me want to kill myself when I finished it. <laughs> yeah, it's, you know. Mm. Maybe you should upgrade your combat skills. <laughs> Oof. Oof. So, last mission, and then we'll wrap up. Listen, she's not getting no sleep. I'm not getting no sleep, so we're both on even playing fields. Yeah. But it's also the fact that, like, I gotta get home and do shit. Yeah, sure, whatever you say, loser. Right. Fuck yeah! Progress! What's your guys' thoughts on how kids are stealing plumbing pictures and posting it online? Yeah, what? it's stupid. Oh, so, like, there's a... There's a trend on TikTok where kids are just, like... Wiling the fuck out, I guess. Like, destroying a bunch of... Kids being incredibly violent. That's scary. Like, stealing school buses. Destroying public bathrooms. Stealing Stop. shit and posting it online. We're uh, getting ever so closer to, like, 
being forced to hold a kid at gunpoint because he's actively trying to kill you for a TikTok video. I mean, that's literal clockwork orange shit. This is the world we live in now, Lolly. I'd pay $150 for a Black Lagoon shoot him up. I would also pay a bunch of money. Because that'd be sick. Stop. 304. Yep. It's 305 now. Hey, sure, get some puss puss. I appreciate you. That's cute. What's his name? His name is Lolly. Thank you very much. Nice Jim Sterling impression, Shoda. Thank you. I'm about to get racist! He turned Wait, YouTuber into or date? Killers! What you talking what? about? Wait, YouTuber or date? Yeah, right, nobody cares for a man who can't S rank every mission in DMC5 <laughs> on DMD difficulty. We will plug the PS4 in. I will boot DMC5 up, and I will show you I have S rank every mission in that game. He'll do it. Lolly, I think Lolly has seen it. You saw it when you, you came over. You showed it to me. I was yeah. gonna say you you showed it one day because I was bitching about the fucking Virgil boss fight and how I was having a conniption fit. This is why you get fit, boys. It's true. Uh, just don't even don't even bother. It's don't fun. even bo don't even bother. Just keep moving through the level. It's fun. I love the way he does his fucking dive kick. I know. <laughs> get ready, because things are about to get prejudicial. Yeah. It's unironically 9 a.m. for me. Yeah. 